hey guys in this video i will show you how you can use bootstrap alert in angular so guys to use bootstrap alert you have to add bootstrap css and bootstrap js in your project but if you don't know how to add bootstrap js and bootstrap css so go to the description and i have added the link in description so watch these two videos and then you can start to add bootstrap alert in your project so guys open a new tab in browser and here i will type ng bootstrap so you can see the angular power bootstrap the, the, and i will click this first link and here is the uh, open bootstrap site so i will go to the component and you can see here the alert component so i will add a alert from here and you can see the basic alert so i will not add this alert i will show you uh, this closable alert so uh, i will go to the code here you can see the in html file i have to add this code so i will copy this and i will go to my visual studio code and here i already open home component.html and home component.ts file so in a html file i paste this code which i copied and i will press ctrl s to save and now i will go to the browser again and here the ts file so you can see here the interface of alert so uh, what is the interface interface uh, contains the declaration of type so you can see type is string and message is string here is declared the type string and message string so interface content declaration of type so i will copy this and go to the visual studio code and in the ts file below the import i will paste this line and open browser again and now here is the alert array so i will copy this array and i will paste this here and now i will go to the browser again here you can see alerts array type alert so i will copy this and below the ng on it i will paste this and now you can see in into the constructor i have to add this line so i will copy this and i will go to the visual studio code and here is the constructor so i will paste this and again i will copy this now i will paste this and control s to save and in html file i will press control s to save so now i will go to the browser and here is the project and you can see the alert is coming so here you, if you press the close icon so it will be close and reset remove the changes so guys if you like this video please subscribe and share